Families beg at Glasgow Soup Kitchen. This is a story not for the faint-hearted. In fact, it's heartbreaking. A couple in Glasgow went to one of the many soup kitchens dotted around at the moment and they had a 10-day-old baby with them and they had to beg them for somewhere to spend the night. The incident took place in Argyle Street and the charity's organisers have already slammed what they call the city's horrific conditions. We've already seen videos of families queuing with children, children that are starving and just want the one meal a day. It's incredible that this can happen in the United Kingdom. Just for clarification, the charity did step in and get this family um, some food and they also got them emergency accommodation for the night. What are Glasgow City Council or even the rest of the SNP doing to combat any of these problems? Glasgow is controlled by the SNP and the living conditions for those people that don't have a lot are absolutely appalling. Yet what do we see? We see the SNP wasting money on foreign embassies that one, they don't really need, two, they're not really entitled to either, if I'm quite honest with you. Secondly, staffing costs have doubled under the SNP. Cranky has 50 PR people working for her to try and spin stories in her favour. Think of all this money, how much that costs, and where this money could be used. We now know, especially from this story, that children and families as young as 10 days old are going hungry and living in true poverty. It's truly heartbreaking and it's such a shame that the devolved administration in Scotland just doesn't seem to care.